Texas Tiger Digs, and I got another box opening here. Uh, you know, uh, in addition to the melody technique portion of this channel, there's going to be a portion of it that's going to just relate to to guy traditionally guy apparatus, but it doesn't really have a gender specific focus. But uh, you know, I mentioned multi tools, and I'm just a multi tool fan. I always have been. I don't know. It's just a gadget. A gadget deal I believe I've uh, developed over the years and uh, I decided to get another multi-tool that I've been dreaming about having for quite some time uh, you know about the uh, the extra large uh, version of the uh, of the uh, Swiss Army knife that I have and there's another uh, very renowned multi-tool and uh, it's the Leatherman and we know the Leatherman varies through a whole lot of different incarnations you can go to the Walmart or to the uh, or to a uh, department store, whatever department stores are left uh, from Walmart. Target, I guess, is about the only other one left. National, and uh, and you can get a Leatherman. Now you can get a Leatherman for five bucks, ten bucks, twenty bucks on up. This is this is the somewhat higher end leather man and that's the one I really like like I like the oversized uh, uh, Swiss Army knife also like the oversized uh, leather man so let's see if I can cut into this and get it out of course it appears to be blister packed like almost all wood leather in a brisk pack. I don't know why I didn't expect this one to be packed a little different than, than the others, but it's still look got the traditional traditional pack that we're all familiar with. So Here we go. The 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 serious leather man. It's called a surge. And uh, it has a lot of the traditional leather man uh, pieces and also has some removable blades and some other things that can uh, be added, upgraded, etc. So, here we go. I don't know what this is. Hmm. Oh, you can, oh, one of the blades you can add. Cool. And the huge number of attachments. So it's a it's a serious multi tool and a nice strong leather case and. All right, you can just fold this up. And we know that the, that the leather man folds up, but this has a lot of the attachments, I believe, from the description, external. To so when you fold it up, you still have access to quite a few things. So a saw blade, uh, scissors. Pretty reasonable size number of scissors, reasonable size scissors as well there, and a an altogether serious pair of pliers, and a very sharp, also removable blades for wire cutters. It has these little star, little star type uh, uh, connectors or screws, where you can actually remove and add different components as necessary. So. That is not bad. And you also have a few components in here. You have the the bottle or can opener. You have a uh, Phillips head screwdriver on the outside there. And on this side you have a, a punch, a a straight edge and two straight edge screwdrivers, one large, one small. 
and some other components here. Let's see what they got here. Of course, it's going to take some consult, some consulting of instructions to figure out everything you've got on here. But it's pretty nice. 27, 28. It promises uh, 28 uh, different attachments, and it also gives you instructions on how to add and remove uh, bits and pieces. So, a blade exchanger. Great. Hard wire, stranded wire. So you've got a full range of, uh, of wire strippers here, even on the inside here. So that's pretty cool. I gotta admit that, uh, that this this will be useful. And since some of my uh, method technique includes making mods, and uh, this would be a nice little tool to have handy. Because it's, it's easier for me to keep up with one thing than half a dozen screwdrivers, etc. So uh, that's pretty cool. So I just wanted to introduce you to the Surge, and uh, I think I'm sure I'll be using this more and more often. But this is uh, the medium to high end, close to high end of the uh, of the Leatherman line, and it uh, it really does look good. Though it's packed like the the, the cheaper standard Leatherman, it does have a good. Uh, it has a good case. So, alright, that's another tool I'd like to introduce. And you'll be seeing those off and on, but uh, I'm not going to actually do a running review of those. Or I might mention them before if they're not, if they don't do what they're supposed to do. But like I say, I'm, I'm going to be doing some mods and some, some dismantling and reassembling some things. And yeah, it's going to be a nice little handy piece to have. In any case, uh, this is a. Uh, Texas Tiger Digs again, uh, introducing you to the other portion of the channel, which is just pure multi-tool. You know, a lot of the multi-tools I've got also have a function, and uh, the shovels, etc., of course, also have a function as a tool in my metal detecting. And these are just good tools to have. And uh, and one thing you know about this group is a very this this is a very not Gaia-oriented, agenda-specific, but the traditional things we like tools, etc. Hunting, there's gun guys of all sorts and styles, bushcraft, etc. So I don't think that's really beyond the range of the interest of my uh, of my uh, subscribers and future subscribers, hopefully, on this channel. So I will talk to you later and uh, be more toys and fun to have and more detecting. Detecting is the primary thing. I'll be out probably tomorrow no matter when you see this it'll probably i'll probably be out that next day so we'll see you have a wonderful day and uh hope you like the the two section let me know whether you like the two section or you'd like to uh or you'd like not to have it uh, i would accept either one i will uh, talk to you later you have a wonderful day